Hi friends, welcome to my channel. I am so hyped up and excited because today, I don't even see it. I got my suitcase here with me and I got my cute little carry-on backpack here with me. And if you haven't guessed yet, we're doing a pack with me, kind of, kind of, kind of. So I'm kind of doing a little bit pack with me, kind of sort of not really, because I'm going on a cruise. Oh, I'm so excited. And so I thought it'd be really fun to do like slightly pack with me, but a little bit more of like what I'm packing, kind of essentials, what I feel like you need, that type of thing. Hopefully it'll be fun. Maybe do a little bit of try-ons, but yeah, so it's just stuff that I bought specifically for the cruise or things that I don't really need or just whatever, you know, I just I bought stuff. It's a great reason to buy things because I love shopping. So we're going to jump right into it. We are going to Mexico. It's going to be nice and toasty. I don't even know where I want to start. Maybe I should open my suitcase first. Okay, my suitcase is right here. So obviously, I'm going to need some swimsuits. I've got, let's see, I've got this one. This is, I've got some shit in front of me. This is the lounge one that I have try on in that lounge um, try on haul video. I'll link it up here or below, wherever. So that's definitely coming with me. I've got a few Kira swim swimsuits. If you follow me on Instagram, when we were in Jamaica, I posted in these. This is like my favorite one by them. It's the Rome, R-O-W-M-E, if they still offer it. I absolutely love it. It is just so freaking flattering. I have smaller boobs and it, it looks real nice. So that's definitely coming with me. It did come with this cute little case too. So I have another one by them, this blue one. I don't like it as much. The top tends to kind of like come up if you're not careful, but it's still really soft and again, flattering. So I'm just taking all my swimsuits with me if you haven't figured that out. I've got this one from Abercrombie. This one I also posted in before, so you can go to my Instagram, follow me, you friends. That one is coming with me. And then I got it, uh oh. Here's my new one. I got a new one. My husband picked, got this one for me. It's a Gymshark one. So it looks like this. And it's got the zip. I have small boobs, so it doesn't look really cute unzipped on me. It actually doesn't look cute at all. I think if you had bigger boobs, it would actually look really cute unzipped. Um, but on me, it's not flattering. But I do love it zipped up. And it's got this, like, like a, we'll call it a belt. This, like, built-in belt thing is tight it does not stretch so yeah that one is rough so gotta do some wiggling to get in it but once you're in it it's cute and then the back is it's just got a little cut out and the bottoms are more full coverage um but yeah this will just be really nice on days when you like don't want to wear a bikini and it kind of helps like cinch you in a little bit with that belt definitely coming and then of course a swimsuit cover-up this one is from fashion nova I've tried on before on here too. It's really tight and kind of see-through. So I'm going to take this one and I'm also going to take something else. I don't know what yet. Oh, those pants from H&M. I'm going to take those pants. That way, like if I don't, if I feel like I need to be a little bit more covered up, you know what I mean? So I'm going to take that stuff. I also got, oh yeah, this is going to be my bag, like my carry-on bag. So any anything that I need right away, I'll have this with me because when you go on the cruise, they take your luggage, but like you can keep this with you. So I'm going to be keeping this with me. Use this in my carry-on when I went to Pennsylvania. Got this from Macy's. I really like this bag. It's so freaking cute. So yeah, so this is going to hang out with me and just anything that like is not replaceable, you know, that type of thing. I'll have, my husband will have this bag with him. How does it? Yeah, it goes this way. We actually use this in Jamaica too. And it is a waterproof bag and like you roll it up and this is really great. So we'll take it on excursions as well. It's absolutely fantastic. I got some of them for excursions. <laughs> I got a fanny pack. I don't know if you can tell, but it's black camo. I thought it was really cute and just like simple, you know, like not loud and it was black. So kind of go with everything. Some gold detailing. The gold isn't as nice as the gold on this bag. Like... This one looks higher quality. I know it's not real gold. Whereas this one's more like yellowy. I still think it's really cute. I got it off of Amazon. I do like it. The only thing is if you are like, if you're my size, I've got to, 
I feel like the description lied or I'm an idiot and I read it wrong, but it does not fit me it's like right. So I've got to sew it. I think something like this. I think I've got to sew it like this um, to make it fit me. I'll try it on in a minute when I try something else on for you guys so you can see it. But it is really cute and it's got three little pockets. So this big one is kind of like a wallet. And it's got, you know, like a zipper and credit card things. In the next pocket, got more credit card things. Very roomy. In the last pocket, the zipper is a little temperamental on this last one. It's just really small. It is quite roomy. I stuck our selfie stick, whatever it is. Like this, like it goes down to this big and it fit in there. A little tight, but it did get to fit in there. I think you can still get your phone too. So I think it'll be really handy. That way I don't have to worry about carrying a purse and all that jazz. All of these in this the whole time. Super excited. I think it's cute. So, how cute is this skirt? Oh my gosh. So I got this from Fashion Nova. I didn't specifically buy it for the cruise. Abercrombie had this faux leather one that I wanted so bad. But they didn't have my size and it wasn't on sale and it was really expensive. And I couldn't find another faux leather one, but I did find this one on Fashion Nova. And I'm going to try it on with this. This is a Gymshark bodysuit, like really casual, so friggin' soft. I'm just going to try it on with this and I'll try on the fanny pack so you guys can see. But we'll see what it looks like So I feel like it could be a cute outfit for like, we're doing a Jose Cuervo tequila experience. Maybe something for that where you still look cute, but you're comfortable. We'll see. I'll be right back. I don't know, that's actually kind of not a bad combination. It is very mini, but I mean, I've got the bodysuit on, so it's not like I'm really going to show anything. I actually kind of like this combo, and then let's try another fanny pack, because it's, it's cute, but you know what I mean? Like, it, it's cute, but cute, if that makes sense. Cute, but cute. It's cute, but kind of comfortable. I did just eat lunch. <laughs> Uh, I don't know, I just, I feel nice in it. The only thing is you have to pee real bad. So, this is the fanny pack. So, like I said, it's, it's kind of too big. I'll have to tighten it so that it's more like this. So, here we go. Imagine it with the outfit. You can wear it to the side. You can wear it in the, I don't like it in the front. You can put it in the back. I don't really like that either. At least not with this. I think to the side, it would just be like it. What do you guys think? The only thing is the skirt is like riding up and then you've got a slit. But like I said, I've got a bodysuit on. I guess that just does look like my underwear. <laughs> I don't know. I might be safer to wear shorts. We'll see. But regardless, super cute. Both of these will, well all three of these will be coming with me on the cruise. So it's so cute. So cute. I did also get I can't believe it. I didn't have a black cardigan and I was worried like if I'm cold in a restaurant or something like that. It's all gonna look nice. So I picked up this one. It had good reviews. It looks okay, it's just fuzz. Ugh. It's got a lot of fuzz on it, it's kinda of gross. I mean like look at that. That's an active. Can you guys see all the fuzz on that? Okay, so I don't know what's up. With that, Ugh. I'm assuming it just came from the factory like that, or their warehouse, I mean. It's longer than my skirt. I feel cute. I feel like I look professional. You were late today. I don't know, is that what, maybe not that, like, can't think of a professional thing to say, like. Um, but yeah, I actually like this. It looks really nice. Other than all the fuzz all over it, I think it looks, it looks like a nice piece. It doesn't look really cheap. Same for the skirt. I really like the skirt too. It's super soft. I don't think it looks cheap. I kind of do have to tug it down a little bit. I mean, this is an extra small, extra small, extra small. Even though it says active, it doesn't look like. You're about to go running or anything it looks like a dressier piece which is kind of what i was going for so yeah perfect this will be 
So this will be good for the cruise and just great for like my wardrobe in general, which is kind of what I was going for with everything. And okay, lastly, we're not on excursion, but I got, you'll also believe this, I didn't have a pair of black heels. So I got these, got these. They're a little bit higher than what I thought, but let's like flash you guys. Can you see them? This is, I'm like flashing you. This is what they look like. They're really, they're cute and relatively comfortable. I haven't worn them yet. The only thing I'll say is I'm typically a seven and a half in shoes. So I ordered a seven and a half and these are too big. Like I would probably do a seven. I could maybe even do a six and a half, but I think seven would have been a better bet. So I'm going to have to stick these thingies in the back. Hopefully that'll be okay to keep my foot from slipping out. I also ordered a pair of boots too and same thing happened. I have a pair of seven and a half boots that fit me from them so it's weird but a different pair of boots seven and a half is too big. So just gotta be careful about that if you're interested. I'll try and link everything below. Back to the excursion front. I got these from Amazon for our like ATV excursion where you have to have clothes to have shoes but we're also going to the beach and I didn't want to put on socks and like wet sandy feet and I just thought it'd be gross. So I picked up these from Amazon. They were like 25 or 30 dollars. They're fantastic reviews. They're comfortable, not atrocious, not the cutest things ever, but they're really not bad. And it's adjustable, which I like. And if you adjust it, like this still doesn't get in your way because it's attached to this. So these would be good. I tried them on around the house. They were fine. So yay. Then let's do the fun part and then we'll do the more like Wah, 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 serious stuff. So of course, this is our one year wedding anniversary trip, if you didn't know. So I did pick up a few things. I picked up this little number from Fashion Nova. I can get it, there we go. This little number, pull it to the side so you can kind of see it better. And then I got, these to go with it and I did try this on earlier it is really cute it does feel pretty nice and even in the boob area like I'm smaller there it actually fit pretty good since that's kind of where a lot of times things will fit me everywhere except there the only thing is fair warning this is an extra small my typical size holy smokes okay let's talk about it I think like this so it's got the little belt belt thing and basically like once you have it on it fits you and like you know hugs you like that but there's no stretch to it at all like there's I feel like it looks like it's stretching here but I'm telling you it doesn't stretch that thing was near impossible to get on and I thought I was gonna have to cut myself out of it getting it off it just it doesn't go over the bum and I can't get it back up over the shoulders it was so painful I did finally get it off like it was painful getting on and I didn't think I'd be able to get it on but once it was on I thought it wasn't gonna come off I was like well that stinks shouldn't have tried it on because I really did think I was about to have to cut myself out of it it there's just no stretch to it and it doesn't come off. Really cute. Would recommend it from that aspect, but just be really careful with the sizing. Like seriously, be really, really careful. I thought, I guess what I'm saying is I would be worried. So, okay, so this is too small to get on and off without like dislocating my shoulder or something. But I would be worried that a small would be too big. If that makes sense. So. If you are interested in this, just be cautious with the sizing. Know what you're getting yourself into. It is not stretchy. And that was all I will say. I also got a few things from Lounge. And I got two things from them. I picked these up during their maybe Black Friday sale, the Lights Out Lounge one, I think. I got this one just like a really cozy except honestly because I just really wanted one. They're triangle sets. They're so soft. It's really cute. I really like it. And you know, I have blue hair now, so I kind of thought that would be cute. And then I got a more sultry one. 
I got this little number, black lacy one with these bottoms. Very cute. I guess I shouldn't say cute, but you know what I mean. So that's really nice. And then that's all I got on the fun front. Now to the serious stuff. Things that you need to have with you when you're going on a cruise. Number one, sunscreen. This is still in the bag. I got it from Amazon. This is spray on and this is a rub on. Sun bum. Cruelty free and UV friendly. That's the most important thing. And gluten and vegan. Gluten free. It's not gluten. It's gluten free and vegan friendly. So I got some bum because they're cruelty free and reef friendly. We're going to Mexico. So that was really important to me. And I'm trying to like put more thought into kind of like skincare and makeup. I'm cruelty free, but other things I'm trying to put more thought into. So I picked up some bum from Amazon. I also got earplugs. I'm a very heavy sleeper. My husband is not. So these will more than likely come in handy. I also ordered some Dramamine. He hasn't been on a cruise before, and it's been ages since I've been on one. This is going to be my second one. So just in case anybody gets seasick, pop some drama me. Some lotion. This is Simple Truth. They says, they says, it does say no animal testing. Um, I don't know, like, how do you find out if they're lying or not? Can you just put that on there? If anybody knows, let me know, because that would be great. But I picked up the coconut vanilla scent. I just didn't have a travel lotion. So I thought this would be really handy to have around. And a, I thought this was cool, a bamboo toothbrush. We don't take our toothbrush with us when we travel since we have the electric ones and it's just a little bit more of a hassle. So I picked up a more eco-friendly option than the traditional plastic ones. So I thought that was really fun and really cool. I think that's everything I wanted to tell you guys about. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. I thought it was really fun to just kind of chat and show you guys some stuff. If you did like it, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit the bell. That way you're notified whenever I post a video. I try and be here Fridays at 6 p.m. EST. I feel like I have to sneeze. Oh, we can make it through. And thank you guys so much for watching. I feel see you next time. Bye. Explain yourself. Where's my budget report? I don't know. <laughs> I really do have to pack though. Like I gotta get my packing done today.